my brother is a he Look at how cute it is. Ooh, I'm talking about you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Welcome to Vlogmas Day 6. I'm currently at work. I'm working on our Christmas booklet that we're including in all the Christmas boxes. Each educator has their own page and we talk about a family recipe, a family tradition, and what our plans for the winter break are. So I'll show you guys my page. It's like super cute. So this is my page. My recipe is snowballs, which I make every single year with you guys on Vlogmas. So that'll be coming at some point. And then I put this guy because it's supposed to be me and my mom baking. I'm clearly very little in this picture. Also, I have brown hair apparently. And then that's my family traditions. Every year, my parents would take us, me and my brother, to the movie theater to watch a movie because we were always so excited for Santa and we're always really, really hyper. So it was their way to get us to calm down and be quiet for an hour and a half. And then we always read the night before Christmas in my mom's bed and then put out the milk and cookies for Santa and the carrots for the reindeer. I also do like this thing with glitter every year. I believe I filmed it the past three years as well for Vlogmas, but I might put that in because I have so much like space here. But then I talk about spending time with family. Those are my plans and obviously Remy Boo, my little puppy baby boy. I'm not going to show you guys the other educators pages because you know confidentiality you can't know who works with me <laughs> and then we also have like a kindness bingo that we have to do we have to make resource page for like different like organizations so i did like food banks toy banks a adopt a family or a senior for the holiday a baby depot boutique which is like donating baby clothes so either the families can choose to donate or if they're in need they can go and you know use those services and then what else do i have oh we have a front page i'll show you like the bottom of it but i'm not going to show you guys like the actual page because it says where i work so up there it says where I work and then this is just what we're including in the box. So all of that stuff and obviously I'm not going to show you the rest of it because it says all of our names and the school that I'm at and blah blah but that is the front page. I think it's really cute. And then I also did a scavenger hunt. I can't show you the top because again it says my school name so we're not doing that but it's really cute. They get to go out searching for this stuff with their families and then go inside and have a cup of hot cocoa which I'm giving them. And then I'm currently working on the card game manual for the families which I am actually really excited about because we gave them all a packs of cards to play and I'm hoping that they actually do play. The kids in my program at least the class that I'm in because I'm with the grades ones to three right now because I have two new educators in that room so I kind of have to stay with them to make sure that they're not you know messing up but those kids love card games so I'm giving them a little manual to bring it back to their families to play but that's what I'm currently working on it's only 10 7 I have to be here till 11 so I'm thinking that I'll probably at least get the booklets done which I'm excited about and then I need to start making the boxes there is so much shit in my house right now and I just need to get it out of there or mom's gonna go crazy but the only problem is is that I don't have space here to store it because my room is just like covered in resource stuff like all this these books they go literally all the way around my room and on my top shelf over there and then there's like resource stuff over on the counter as well like i can show you guys like all of that used to be my space all of that used to be my space all of that stuff over there used to be my space and now it is covered in other people's shit so I lost a lot of my shelving space, which is really annoying. So there's literally no room to store 41 boxes in here, technically 40, because one is for the hub, which is like the big bosses in our corporation because we're supposed to show them like what we did. So I lost all my space, so I have literally nowhere to put it. I don't know what I'm going to do. What I'm thinking is probably going to happen is that we're going to build all the boxes at my house and then my mom is going to drive them over the night before we're supposed to hand them out so that they're not in our house and they're just sitting on the table for when the kids come in and then I'll hand them out to the parents in the morning. Hopefully all the kids will show up so I don't have a bunch of extra boxes just sitting around. Do you guys want to see all the artwork that my kids make? me and have me hang up in the room because they're like the cutest little freaking things ever they just keep giving me artwork and they're like it's for you we love you so this is what my room looks like
Look at this. It's so sweet. Oh, and then a little girl made me that bracelet, but it doesn't fit me because I have apparently big wrists, which I don't. They're really small. But like, look how cute. Love my kiddos, but I'm going to go work on this for more time. And hopefully it takes me to 11 o'clock and I also need to clean. This place is a pigsty. Ugh. What are you making, mom? So fancy. Christmas crap. He's making it for the ornament so that it will look like You're that. lucky that you have a mummy that likes to do this shit. This is what she's making. And then they're gonna put cardstock in it that says their wishes for 2022. Blech. And then they can roll it up a little bit, stuff it in, put the top on. The other ones actually have a tag on it. This is the one that I broke. Cut off. And then we also have this confetti with green cardstock. And then that one mom's doing now is the blue one. And then this one is the gold cardstock. And I guess the red is for this one too. Yeah. I'm currently at Walmart waiting for my grocery order. Every Monday we have to do a huge grocery order for the rest of the week for program for before and after school. So they have a morning snack and an after school snack. So I buy for Monday to Friday on the Monday. So I'm just waiting. It's been like 10 minutes, but it should be out soon. They're usually not too, too slow. I'm not literally only person in this parking lot right now, so they should be pretty quick. Usually if there's like a lot of people, then it takes them a long time, obviously, but should be pretty fast today because I'm literally the only person here. So fingers crossed I actually get back to work at three o'clock like I'm supposed to. He's here, he's here, he's here. Mom's being my elf again. Cause I made these card game manuals. And it's all the games you can play with your family. I tried to pick the really, really easy games because some of the kids are four, so, you know. The older kids can play poker and gin rummy. Yeah, but and, I didn't think I'd include that. The younger kids play go fish. Poker. I like poker. Some of the kids can play poker. Why not? I was kidding with what I was saying. No, I know you were, but she said yeah. I like poker. We're teaching them valuable lessons, okay? Well, I taught them high-low. What's that? <laughs> it's a drinking game. Okay, we have the setup and Curtis's really cool socks. <laughs> but we have the setup for all of the kindergartners' boxes to be done tonight. all my baby kinders done except mom has to redo the labels because she did it on the non-sparkly side mother but mom has neater writing than me so it's, it's not even neat it's neater than mine thanks elf i love you do you want me to put the kettle on for you yep it's 9 30 now i forgot to close vlogmas and i need to go to bed because i have to get up at six o'clock so thank you for joining me for vlogmas day six i'll see you tomorrow bye